All right, time for the next heat two race of the day. Then the cadets have made their way out for heat number two, the 2023 Oscar Racing Season Championship round number four here at Warwick Car Club. And the cadets make their way out for heat number two. On track, in one, Maxwell Padilla. Out of two, Kano Caldwell. From three, Zane Sturgis. Out of four, Ty Bradley. Out of five, Brody Marr. Out of six, Lincoln Adams. From seven, Alex Lundins. From eight, Jensen Clout. From nine, Ashton Lusty. From ten, Indiana Bennett. They are the drivers. And I want to see what Brody Marr can do. Because Brody has got himself a third row berth. Could be a mighty interesting race. They all form it up then. They'll go through the shortcut. It all got shaken up last time round as it came through Skipper's building group. It all got a little bit messy and uh, that put a massive gap between them. So we didn't see what we thought we might see. This time though, let's see how we go. Past the Tower of Terror they go. Into Puff. Now they head on to Sinkins. We're ready to go. Cadets. Green. Light. Racing. And away we go. Padilla gets a bell to start. Jensen Clark trying to make his way through the field. He's going to get at least up to six, is he? Yes, he does. Jensen Clark got a bell to start. But oh, Kano. Kano's having a crack at Padilla. Kano. Giving it everything. He's on the inside. Sturgis is going to try and go as well. Kano surely goes to the lead. I'm pretty sure that is it. They look identical, but Kano should emerge in front. Indeed he does. It's all been shaken up and stirred and Clyde right up there with them. So it is. Coldwell, Medina, Sturgis. One, two and three. Clyde's up to six and he's right behind Mark Brody. Giving it everything. Brody Marr, hanging on in there, back with him, behind him, Adams, and Lasdins, Bennett and Lusty, down Sinkins, they go through DPE, no lift through DPE, remember, flat out into Skipper's building group, the front through, whoa, wide, wide, Padilla goes wide, Sturgis gets him, Sturgis goes through, Ty Bradley's right with him, then Jensen Clark, then it's Marr, Clark, Adams, Lasdins, Lusty and Bennett, through, Lynn's healthy hub they go, back towards me, and still Kano hanging on, but it's not Padilla, it's Sturgis with him this time, Sturgis is after him, do they go into Chaos Corner, now they head to pub, Kano, Sturgis, Padilla, Bradley, Clout, then Adams, followed by the remaining pack as they go down Sinkins into DPE. Still the lead pair locked together and it's still... Oh, Kano also went wide. Coldwell, Sturgis, Padilla, Bradley, Cloud, Adam, Lastins, Lusty, then Bennett, then Marr has gone to the back. Brody has had a big drama. Brody Marr has gone to the back of this race and has had an issue somewhere. He's right behind the Indiana Bennett, but here come your leaders, and it's still on like Donkey Kong, and still they're going for it. The Cadets are giving us what we wanted, but the front two really started to get it on. Kano holds, Sturgis at bay at the moment. Sturgis, though, he's going to try and go through with him for sure. He goes wide. Sturgis trying to get the run down, thinking, and he does so. He should switch to the inside. Oh, the door shut. He thought about a move to the inside. He'll have another go. In. Skipper's building group deep on the brakes and holds him at bay. Still Sturgis is right there and he still can't get to him. Kano, Sturgis, Padilla, Bradley, Clout. That's your front five. Then a scrap. Check it out. Adams and Lasdins. Lasdins having another crack at him though. As they go down into Lynn's healthy hub. Lasdins can have another look. He's going to go on the inside. Lasdins. He thought about it in the double apex left but didn't go. Lasdins has another look. Back towards me they come. Lasdins and Adams look together. Still he's on his tail. Adams holds. Adams. In that TGR cut. Back through chaos karting. Lasdins trying to go wide. Now he's going to switch to the inside. Lasdins right on his tail. Adams holds him up. Behind them still. Lusty. Then Ma. Then it's Indiana Bennett. 
as the lead has, oh it's a three way at the front, Padilla's caught them all, Padilla now has made it a three way, Sturgis still hanging on to the shirt tails, Kano looked over the left shoulder momentarily to see who was there and they are banking up behind him. He knows they're there and he's just driving the wheels off the 41 cart and he's going to do it to the end of this race. Round they go, through chaos. The white flag is about to be shown. Oh, again, Sturgis goes high, wide and handsome at the switcheroo. He's got the run. Sturgis, he's going to go through. Yes, he does. He's on the inside. He gets it done. Sage Sturgis to the lead. Kano's going outside suicide, trying to shut the door on Padilla. He holds it at bay. Sturgis looks over the right shoulder, sees where he is. Big, big lead. Through they go, through the right hander. Oh, big slide from Sturgis. Did it balk him? Kano couldn't find a way past. He's got one last chance. Coming to Chaos Corner. Will he be close enough for a move? Sturgis again looks over the shoulder. Does he shut the door? Oh, he did, he shut the door. They won't get him now unless they can get the run into turn five. And it is, Cadets, he's number two. Your winner, Sage Sturgis. Second, Kano Caldwell. Third, Maxwell Padilla. Fourth, was it Clank? It was. It was Jensen Clank got four from Bradley, from Lincoln Adams. Then it was... Last in, followed by Ashton Lusty. Then it will be Brody Mar, followed by Indiana Bennett. A great heat number two. Oh, Indiana does a bit of a triple salco, keeps it going. Well done, Indiana. That was heat number two of the cadets. Oh, that's getting a bit loose, a little bit ragged.